Is this true? The Huawei Kirin 9000S chip has left the US government and the tech industry frustrated and exasperated. Recently, the White House claimed that the Huawei Kirin 9000 chip uses an unknown technology. Multiple U.S. research institutions are expected to announce the abandonment of decryption efforts because it is speculated by relevant researchers that Huawei's Kirin 9000S likely uses quantum entanglement encryption technology. Due to China's far-reaching lead in the field of quantum technology, it has become difficult for the European and American tech communities to crack the secrets of the Kirin chip. This has caused a great deal of frustration for the United States and has left the ubiquitous U.S. intelligence agencies in an awkward position. The question arises, what exactly is the quantum entanglement technology in the Huawei Kirin chip? Quantum entanglement encryption technology is a method that utilizes the phenomenon of quantum entanglement in quantum mechanics to achieve absolutely secure communication. It is based on the quantum key distribution mechanism, allowing both communicating parties to possess a random and secure key for encrypting and decrypting information. In the quantum key distribution mechanism, each of the communicating parties receives one of the entangled particles. Since measuring either particle would destroy the quantum entanglement, any eavesdropping attempt would be detected by the communicating parties. Quantum entanglement encryption technology is considered a form of encryption technology that can guarantee absolute communication security. Its emergence has shown us the future of secure and reliable communication and has filled us with anticipation for the future of quantum technology. The White House's inability to crack the Huawei Kirin chip technology has left them frustrated. According to CNN reports, the U.S. is continuously condemning Huawei for not disclosing the Kirin chip foundry, expressing great disappointment and a lack of respect for the U.S. government. This kind of behavior makes the White House seem like a petulant child throwing a tantrum in front of young people, even though it's several hundred years old. Previously, Bill Gates of Microsoft stated, the U.S. restrictions on Chinese companies purchasing chips from U.S. companies will ultimately only lead to the loss of high-paying jobs for their own people, while China will gradually achieve self-sufficiency in this context. Looking at the current situation, Bill Gates' words have come true. The U.S. ban on Huawei's chips for three years has enabled Huawei to develop a practical alternative solution domestically and the IDM model has left the US with no effective way to suppress them. The Huawei Kirin 9000S chip has garnered widespread attention globally due to its exceptional performance and advanced technology. However, some foreign research institutions, after studying this chip, have been unable to crack its internal structure and core technology, leading to doubts about its technological content and strength. The reason why foreign research institutions are unable to crack the Huawei Kirin 9000S chip is that it is a 5 nanometer process mobile chip that integrates a series of high-tech components such as 5G baseband chips, AI processors, CPUs, and GPUs, with powerful computing capabilities and low energy consumption. These features make the Kirin 9000S chip the core component of Huawei's new flagship Mate 40 series. However, Huawei has always kept the technical content and details of the Kirin 9000S chip highly confidential, never disclosing too much information to the outside world. This has led to speculation and conjecture about the technical level and internal structure of the chip. Some foreign research institutions have concluded that they cannot crack the internal structure and core technology of the Kirin 9000S chip through analyzing its appearance and functionality. These institutions believe that the chip adopts a highly integrated design, making its internal structure very complex and involving highly advanced technology. Furthermore, the manufacturing process of the Kirin 9000S chip also utilizes the world's most advanced 5 nanometer process technology, making its manufacturing extremely challenging and requiring a high level of mastery of its process details and core technology. Therefore, even if some foreign research institutions want to crack the internal structure and core technology of the Kirin 9000S chip, it would require significant effort and cost point too. 
Huawei's technological secrecy measures As a global leader in the technology field, Huawei has implemented a series of measures to protect its technological secrets. These measures not only include the confidentiality of the company's core technologies but also encompass secrecy in product design and manufacturing processes. Firstly, Huawei has made significant investments in technological secrecy. With a comprehensive internal system and mechanism for safeguarding technology. For instance, in the research and development phase, Huawei employs agile development management, dividing research and development personnel into multiple small groups that operate independently with limited communication and coordination between them. Additionally, Huawei enforces strict technological secrecy policies, providing confidentiality training and education for employees and implementing severe penalties for any breaches of confidentiality. Secondly, Huawei has implemented a range of secrecy measures in product design and manufacturing. For product design, Huawei utilizes a multi-layered design approach, creating circuit board designs with multiple layers and employing techniques such as blind and buried vias to minimize the number of soldering points, making the internal structure and circuitry extremely difficult to decipher. Moreover, in product manufacturing, Huawei employs highly automated production lines and advanced process equipment, making it challenging to grasp the technological details of the manufacturing process. Point 3. Predicament of foreign research institutions For foreign research institutions, attempting to crack the internal structure and core technology of the Huawei Kirin 9000S chip is no easy task. Firstly, these institutions would need to invest significant effort and resources to decipher the chip structure and manufacturing process details. Furthermore, even if they were to successfully uncover the internal structure and core technology of the Kirin 9000S chip, substantial investment would be required to produce chip samples and conduct testing and validation. Additionally, even if foreign research institutions were to successfully decipher the technical details of the Kirin 9000S chip, they would need to consider how to integrate them into their own products and achieve commercial applications. Therefore, foreign research institutions face significant challenges and difficulties in deciphering the Huawei Kirin 9000S chip. Additionally, due to Huawei's stringent technological secrecy measures, Obtaining information about the chip's technical details and manufacturing processes presents a major obstacle for foreign research institutions. In conclusion, the main reasons why the Huawei Kirin 9000S chip is difficult to crack are its highly integrated design approach and advanced manufacturing process. Furthermore, Huawei's stringent technological secrecy measures contribute to the significant challenges and difficulties faced by foreign research institutions in deciphering the chip. However, with the continuous development and progress of technology, it is believed that more and more technological details will be revealed in the future.